Yeah, boy. Everything but the secrets. To me, the perfect level. All right. Everything but the secrets. Yeah. Oh, it, it's like summoning shit here. I just realized when I pressed them. All right. There's some random texture to use to lower the gates. Yeah, it sounds about right. Okay, that's a lot of stuff here. You know what? Let's just go over here for a sec. What? What a troll! <laughs> oh, whatever. I'm going back to the quick save. They're like, get your ass out of the room. What are you doing here? This is doom. Oh, oh my god, there's like homing rockets here. What? Why are these things firing rockets now? You know, I was just saying how, oh, there's no remnants in this game. I don't have to worry about rockets. Thank fuck for that. Apparently not. <laughs> They're the don't be a pussy missile. <laughs> Oh my god. I like how it spawns it in my fucking spawn room where it's safe. Apparently not safe at all. Oh god. Yeah, find the blue key, you dork. Oh shit, that's the... This is don't be pussy rockets again. I can't see anything in there. Oh, they're, 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 they're Rakitrons, I see. Okay, yeah, we're just gonna fire into the darkness. Oh, look, it's the head of uh, the guy who made the music. <laughs> All right. Why is that? I'm confused on what that was. Oh, it's oh, it's trying to tell me which 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 one is it under. Oh, <laughs> I was not paying attention to that at all. Let's try this one. Oh, dude, I got it. One hundred percent intentional. I was totally paying attention. Believe me, that wasn't just a one in five chance. Oh shit. The correct one is wherever the, the first uh, soul sphere shows up. Well, that's interesting to know. It's like I said, you th I wasn't paying attention at all. Oh shit. No, let me out, let me out. Alright, cool. Just regular kinds of danger and not homing rocket danger. Hey, wait, these imps in fight? Kind of neat. I probably should just kill these guys. Actually, where's my rockets? I hate rockets. Imps and nightmare imps. Yeah, but they're the same species. They should get along. Which is, uh... <laughs> something you can quote me on. <laughs> Come on, we're all the same species. Get along. No infighting, guys. Humans are the same species. I, I wasn't going to go there, but you know. <laughs> Listen, man. Well, let's, that, that's a can of worms we are not going to open right now. It's like a football stadium down there. Actually, they're infighting. Let me let them infight. Why not, Mike? Why not? Yeah, Twitch has like a safety council now. Okay, we we can, we 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 cannot talk about those things anymore. 
Cannot talk about world issues, just doom issues. Like why the why the slightly different colored species of imps hate each other. <laughs> I, I don't want to hear about their safety council, please. I've heard enough. I've heard enough. Honestly, it's all people post about on my Discord, is uh, the safety council. You prefer safety dances to safety councils? I don't know, they were doing something like they were against like voice chat in games or something, I don't know. Who knows? There, there, was, there was some spiel about it. I just looked at it, I'm like, this sounds ridiculous and that's it. Alright, so let's get these people to fight each other. There you go, now they're fighting each other. Is there another one up there? I think there's another one up there. Mike, you know there's a brutal doom of this? Uh, I mean probably. I just want to play something a little more original to the, uh, the port of it. I've, I've played enough, like, uh, brutal doom, to be honest, to last a lifetime. Oh yeah, they killed him. I actually fucking died. <laughs> oh, I have 14 HP right now, I didn't even notice. <laughs> I'm running around with 14 HP this whole time. Voice chat is an unfair advantage. Can I be honest, some of the best moments I've had in video games is when voice chat was on. You simply do not get that same exper experience when you don't hear a thick accent telling, telling you how bad you are at Dota. It's very motivating, honestly. Okay, so there's there's some really good pickups in there, but I can't quite get to them yet. Uh, let's can't do anything up there. There's there's nothing there's nothing better than a, a thick Russian accent. Telling you he's he's gonna take mid or feed. All right, and that that just teaches you about the real world. If you don't give your boss mid, then he's gonna feed at your work. All right, hopefully these do something. No, I shoot them. Oh yeah, I do shoot them. Okay, so we shoot them from over there. That's the answer. And violence also solves everything. That's also the the, the the lesson here. What? Okay, which one did I do? Oh, I see. I have to shoot them both. Oh my goodness! You have to be crack shot with this. Look at this stuff. Look at look at. Oh wait, maybe not. Wait, how do you do that? What? Oh, I have to like time it. Yeah, that's the that's the one. Holy shit! Oh no, you don't. No, I, I, just, I was just terrible at games. Never mind. It's it's actually not that complex, or maybe it is. I, I'm I'm kind of curious. What happens when you do it in the other order? Oh yeah, no. When you do it in the other order, it doesn't go down all the way because it stops at the it, it the, the one at the top stops at the level of the second one, so there's an order to it. What do you mean, typical Mike? I'm learning. <laughs> Can I not learn games? Come on. <laughs> I actually figured it out, okay. You have, to, you have to give me some credit. When usually I wouldn't figure anything out. Alright, so I made the thing go down.
If only Twitch and YouTube actually lis uh, listen to people uh, using their stuff for things to be a lot better than... What? What? What are you guys... Oh, you guys are fucking still talking about that stuff? Well, I mean, to be honest, though, you got to think about it logically. If you're like a multi-billion dollar company, you know, that, that hosts like streams and or videos or whatever that they do, uh, who, who the hell is going to be the bigger threat to you? Is it companies that sue you or the users who use your site? Especially when those users don't have a choice in where they go, you know? What are you going to do? Quit quit Twitch and go to Mixer? Or quit YouTube and go to Daily Motion or whatever? Fuck it. <laughs> Congratulations, you're in obscurity now. It's, it's just a reality of the situation, you know? It's just how it goes. I don't agree with it. I don't like it, but you know. That's how it goes. I think I use this teleporter. Listen, I, I've been there, man. I've, uh, I, I tried to be the, the number one stream on Hitbox, okay? Guess where it got me? Nowhere. <laughs> Nobody gave a fuck. That's <laughs> just how it goes. <laughs> you know? You, <laughs> I, I live in obscurity. Mike, don't judge me. Yeah, I don't know. Alright, I think I'm dying to this shit now. Oh, alright. You know what? No, you know what? We're not gonna get hit by a single one. I've decided this. It just stops. Oh, it was one of those things that's just like whatever. This one I was like gonna try hard. It, it stops. Oh, I wonder. Do they get hit by the traps? Um, I guess we'll never find out because they don't seem to actually come over here. No, they don't, they don't actually come here. That's sad. I would have liked to see them see if they took damage from these traps. They do, but they just don't walk walk up the walkway. Yeah. Oh, there's an Arachnotron there. And also there's me getting hit by a rock in the face. I kind of want that Arachnotron to hit, the, hit them. Okay, there you go. Now, now they're gonna infight a little bit. We'll let him go do that. Don't, don't. The game glitched out and reloaded. The, the hitboxes are the size of the sun with these rockets. I have to be very careful. Also, where are the Erectatrons? They came up a little bit later. Flip. Alright, we're just chain gun this guy. Just run, run, just rush them with the chainsaw gun. No, um, I don't think so. Also, how, these guys did proc before. What the hell? I guess I, I guess I have stray rocket must have hit them. That's why they came up there. All right, so I guess we go here. Yeah, it seems pretty accurate. You know what I miss? I miss the rocket room. That's what I miss. Oh yeah, there we go. I was just thinking to myself, this room was a little bit too easy. <laughs> oh shit, I, I got stuck on the wall! <laughs> oh god. There we go, okay. <laughs> Alright, so, uh, we have the red key card now. Is there any other thing that we want here now? Yeah, just come out, guys. Come out and party. Damn it. Your buddy didn't want to come out. Get out. Alright. The silent balls of death. Yeah, they don't really make rocket noises, do they? They must have, you know, I, I have to say, the devs must have known that, uh, what's it called? 
Doom, the Doom 2 uh, art uh, revenants were a thing, you know. That, that's that's the that's the kind of the the feeling I get from that one. They they knew, man. They knew. They just wanted to program it without having to make an enemy for it, I guess. Just homing rockets. Because I I'm assuming it was in active development at some point that time. I mean, actually, no, it didn't or wasn't it already out? It just occurred to me, this was like a 1997 game. Cool. Not cool. I opened the shutters. Let's just go out here. I actually literally cannot go out here. This thing serves no purpose other than to, for me to shoot at these guys. Oh my god, the fireballs are so slow, I actually got hit by one. <laughs> Eat rockets. Alright. Uh, oh, we could actually just go out here. What's the point of the shutters then? What? What is that? Well, it, it was a one-time thing. Maybe, maybe, maybe I didn't do the thing I thought I did, so... Oh, right, there you go. That guy opened up. <laughs> I could just go outside, why even have windows? You know, my thoughts exactly. That's why my house doesn't have windows. Actually, that, that's technically like just a basement unit. And I think about it. You know, don't, honestly, uh, can I be honest with you guys? Don't knock windows. Because I once stayed in like an Airbnb somewhere where like I was in like a, a basement unit in this room and it was the worst thing ever because I was actually working and sleeping in there for like like two weeks and it was actually the worst thing. It fucks with you so much because uh, it's 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 like you, you don't even know how much you need the sun until you don't have it. And then it's like you, you sleep, you wake up and it's like the same lighting all the time in that room. And I'm just like, I cannot, I cannot live like this. It actually messes with you. It's not even, no, it's not even cabin fever. Like, you, you don't know what it's like until you actually try it. Because it's like, I, I got, went crazy after day one. And I'm like, I have to leave all the time now at this place. Because it's like, you don't know what time of day, time of day it is. Oh, right over there, I'm going this way. It's it's so so dumb, uh, but I am crazy all the time. Okay, more crazier than usual. All right. I I actually just, I mean, to be honest, I just love going outside, uh, which is obviously not what I should say as like a hardcore indoors gamer all the time. <laughs> I, I like doing fun things outside, I should say. Like motorcycle things. It's just rainy today. There's nowhere to go right now. Oh, hey. Oh, it's this guy. Oh, hey. You can go... Here, there's a... Baron of Hell or whatever. Right, the guy is, I forget the name of that someone already said at one point, but I already forgot, which tells you how much my memory is. Now, I feel like, actually, you know, I was gonna say circle strafing them feels like cheating, but then again, actually, it's actually not hard to circle strafe things on a controller, I believe. Because, I mean, you can just do it with the analog stick, although you only have one analog stick, so. Oh, uh, this just opens it up, huh? Is that all this was for? What a troll. There's like nothing here. Oh wait, there's a thing here. Does that do anything? No? I guess not. I guess this door was just a piss off. <laughs> Whatever. I'm okay with that. Sounds... It sounds it sounds rough for the 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 the, the door the room with no windows. 
I think I think at one point in your life you should try it. Just just book a place somewhere. Don't think about it. Let's go. Hey, look, this 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 looks cheap. Let's go stay there for for two weeks while you move apartments or whatever. Because it's like the lowest price, you know. You don't you don't think about it, but it it really screws with you. It really does. Good life experience. You need the sun. Just bury yourself alive. <laughs> You know, you, saw, you make it sound way more depressing than it actually was, to be honest. You see, I had the option of leaving. That's the key, right? You wouldn't leave. <laughs> I, guess, I guess that's true for you. Hey, oh, I was gonna do like some wall strafe shit. Oh man, actually, I just go across here. Actually, I think I've been in this place. No, oh my god, this level is so confusing. Actually, already, I've already lost. All right, so it's thing over here. All right, so they've actually experimented with some actual pretty nice non-linear level designs. So here's the thing: I have the red key, um, and it's also zoomed in again. Uh, Oh my god, the fact that they don't put actually the keys on, the key, the, the door colors on the map is atrocious. Alright, so. That, see, this is where I would assume that the next key would be, but it's not. I think this is just a, a fuck you room, honestly. Which I hate those rooms. They're the worst. Yeah, that's what it's looking at, like right now. Okay, so. This is a fuck you room, I guess. Because it just has nothing in there. Um, that's a blue door. That's a box of shells. Hey buddy, I think you got the wrong door, yeah. I don't know why I just shot there. I think I just felt like I had too much ammo, so I had to get rid of some of it. Something, something, leather club's two blocks down. Fuck, dude. Where, where the hell? Oh, this it kind of does this, but you know what? Screw it. Let's do that. Oh, I see. It just goes up there if you, in case you fuck up, I guess. In case you want to go back up there. You can also tell that this is definitely in Tech 1 because they have the same limitations of the engine where, uh, like, they couldn't actually make a, an actual 3D bridge, so they, they, they kind of hack around it, which is always fun to watch when they do things like that. What'd that do? Oh, did that just un undo that? Uh, I don't know if there's something, something more to that. Alright, it really has to be something in this room. I... I uh, am I an idiot? I just assume I'm an idiot somehow. Yeah, I know. I know you locked me out. I have to go up here. Okay, so it's apparently a little bit more convoluted than I would have thought. Blood used some nice tricks to get have planes above planes. I I still have not really played through Blood, to be honest. I, I should at some point, but I have not, and I haven't been here yet, so. My exploration skills are. Oh my god, there's so many of those guys actually. I wanna call them cacodemons, but I don't think they're called cacodemons. Cacodemons I know are lovable and have no arms. And they have that nice smile. It's a smile of the cacodemons that, that makes me, makes my day. Alright. Do a blue key over there. Where are you at? So this is I think behind the yellow door. I believe. I like how it just trolls me, it just puts it right there. I hate this game. No. Okay, we need that. I, I'm guaranteeing you, it has, to be, it has to do something with that door there. There's something I'm missing about it. What? Why would you have a red key, co key door and then not have a, another key behind it? I know I keep coming to this room and I keep not finding anything. Wow, 
Why is this thing like that? Probably really something goofy about this. Yeah. Maybe it just is a troll room, honestly. So this is the blue door. Yeah. Uh, it's maybe something to do with these. I haven't pressed that yet. Oh, here we go. That goes to that. And it also spawns a bunch of lost souls to punish you for being so observant of the button. Actually, it, it did spawn a bunch more items there, so let me go back up there. Because uh, I totally intended to fall there. Oh, I got something here. Let me up. Really nothing here is there. Actually, why would that? Oh, that, that's where the key card was before, I believe. All right, let's go back this way. That's the spawn room. That's the place with the actual door. Go back this way. Oh wait, this uh, yeah, it totally was. Well, I, I mean, who knows what the what the red key card door unlocked actually when I pressed the button? Because maybe some of the stuff wasn't accessible before. It's not like I was paying attention to it. All right, now we can go to the other side. There we go. I like this room. This is a cool room. It's not an overly complex room, but you know, it's cool. It's the green goo room, man. And it makes maneuvering probably hard on a controller. <laughs> I say probably. Oh, fuck. Oh, dude, no! Did it actually just fucking kill me? Oh no, I could go back up here, it's fine. I didn't actually realize there was no way of getting back up. Fuck. See, and at, now that I know I can't get back up, I'm self-conscious about it. I was just navigating this room fine up until one guy knocked me down. <laughs> Breathing intense, plus. It's the green room, indeed. Uh. So we got the we got the last key card, all right. You know what? This is probably one of the better designed levels, but uh, still not one of still not one of my favorites. Okay, hopefully these guys won't fight. Actually, they can't even leave here. Oh, they- oh right! They're not allowed to go through doors with keys, I think. That's what it looks like to me. I was just like... Alright, I guess I'll just kill him. It just feels like I'm not being a good sport right now. I think the point of that is so that they're not allowed to open doors that, that you would need a key card for. Because normally I think the monsters can open doors. So, to be honest, this is actually completely safe. Doors with cheese? I don't know if that's doors with cheese, but it's it's a mechanic so that if, if you if you were to alert them, right, and they start going after you, um, they don't open doors you're not supposed to open yet, because you don't have a key card for it. It's kind of weird that they go, can't go past it completely, but I mean, who knows how it's coded, right? Oh. Fucking traps. What the hell is this? Why do they have a crane here and like just a bunch of body parts hanging from chains? The aesthetics, man. They're all off. Oh, fuck this place. I'm 
Mike, you don't understand the demon decor? I mean, I'm not a demon, so probably not. I mean, I, I did do the, I did do the uh, evil path of Bioshock, but that doesn't mean I'm a demon. I'm just a bad guy, you know? the health there, don't worry. I, I'm just a monster, just a regular monster, you know? Why do I get the feeling that's actually a trap? Because that's like too easy to get. Would you, would you ex uh, accept a barony in hell? Oh, what to, what to call these guys? The name? I mean, that works. Okay, it's probably a trap. Oh, it's not a trap. A legit pickup. You know, for some reason that felt like a secret way, but it wasn't. Oh, look, it's pain elementals with lost souls, except they're not pain elementals, but they are lost souls. Anything else to this place here? Not really. I, I honestly thought I found a secret, but I mean, it's not a very good secret if there was a secret, so you know what? It wasn't a secret. Oh shit. Uh, wait, well, what did, what did I actually just open? Let me just leave. I'm not gonna go in this room again if I don't think there's anything here now. What just opened up? Now it did some funny things. It's like, hey, have a switch at the end of it, and also nothing else changes. Actually, I think this staircase was created. Oh, shit. I should probably just do this at long range, honestly. Where's my, uh... Dude, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have BFG ammo out the wazoo. Because I, I have had very good discipline in not using that BFG ammo. Like, the best, the best discipline. Now, now that I know that rocket rooms exist, I'm very skeptical about this place. Let me in. Uh oh Dr. Petruger, it's you. It was you all along. Oh, frick, I put lost souls here. Maybe I should just use the BFG in this case. But who uses BFG ammo? Oh, shit. Um. Right. That's so cheap. I mean, it does kind of give you an opportunity to get on the platform after this is done, but it's like... <laughs> Who would think to stand in the middle of the room, man? <laughs> oh, man. Alright, blood keep finished. Entering Watcher's Step. Alright, that this does not sound good. Watch your step. Give, the game that does a bunch of cheese traps tells me to watch my step. Alright. <laughs> uh, that's a berserk pack, I believe. I'm just gonna leave that there. Uh, hi. Back. Okay, so... Why is there nothing here? Stop it. Oh, of course, the BFG. Yeah, oh yes. Can I make it onto that thing? No. 
fuck, my phone's like going crazy. I'm gonna just put it like over here somewhere. Sorry. I don't care who's messaging me. So it just gave me, it just gave me a ton of ammo for everything. And here I am wasting that ammo for this. These are not even the red pants, guys. I feel like I have not done a very good job in watching my step, by the way. I've only did an adequate job of that. Let's use these rockets, actually. Fucking... Alright, we need to kind of watch our step, guys, I think. But th this is my own advice, the game didn't tell me to do this. No. No, wrong gun. Fuck, I don't have anything good for this, do I? No, I'm not, I refuse to use that gun. Fuck. <laughs> I kind of I kind of ran out of weapons, to be honest. We have like a ton of BFG ammo for this shit, though. I, I, I probably should use it more liberally, honestly. Because it's actually not, like, it is a power weapon, but it's not as much of a power weapon as you would think. There's so, there's something different with the mechanics of how it works. Where the fuck are these guys actually? Oh, there they are. They're just over there for some reason. Okay, we're gonna, let's get the BFG. Okay, this doesn't even care, kill a Baron of Hell. Or whatever the hell. What the hell? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh god. I even used the BFG on that, that, that crowd. Overall, it, it, yeah, it does feel a little bit weak. Ugh, oh, I just hurt myself by a rocket launcher. Fuck. These guys are the wrong ones to use the rocket launcher on, but I committed to it, so here we are. Fuck. Oh, there's one behind me, too. <laughs> I'm just wondering where... Okay. Where are these guys coming from, actually? I think they're like... Oh, shit. I think they're like teleporting in, I was gonna say. That's what it feels like, they're just teleporting in. Oh, yeah, we can, no, we can't go that way. Oh, hey, it's a blue key card. Oh, hey, they, hey, they, they lined up this time, actually. So they actually just died by... by railgun or whatever. You know, I'm gonna say actually the other guy was right. Lost Souls fucking mean business in this one. Luckily that these guys are susceptible to flinching. Oh my god, is summoning more of them. 
that's where they're coming from. Just keep summoning more shit. I, I, I don't even know if I should be committing to this all the way. But here I am. I'm gonna do. I almost, by the way, thought that this was some kind of like gimmick where you keep walking around in circles and the level keeps changing kind of thing. I'm like, I don't know if the Doom Engine was actually capable of that. Kind of like that, the whole portal effect with it, and you don't even notice you left the place. Hex, uh, Hexen did, actually Hexen did that. Hexen did have that, so you know, I, I, I should give it more credit where credit is due. I think we just go back through, by the way. I think we just have to kill everything there. It's still very ominous why this level's name was Watcher Stup. It, it, it was, it's either, there's a reason to watch your step, or uh, they actually legit couldn't think of a name for this, so they're just like, oh, this is tough, watch their step. Alright. Actually, there's legit nothing here. Actually, that, I literally just killed, oh, wait. No, he's not, he's not here. Oh, hey, oh, here we go. Okay. Whoa. I'm like, I didn't think to press use on that. It looked like something that had to be open elsewhere. I'm like, he just, he just sitting there looking at me and through the grate, right? And dressing me with his eyes. Thinking about all the lost souls he's gonna summon while I'm not there. So I wonder if this is one of those teleporters that's like... Based upon the direction you go in. Oh, hey, you can go this way. Oh good, 66 ammo. The perfect amount of ammo. Just do got a fair bit of those kinds of teleporters. Oh, what the hell? Where the hell am I now? Oh, fuck it. Can you stop fucking just spawning th things in front of me? Oh my goodness. Alright. So let's see if it is one of the teleporters I'm thinking of. So let's go through this. Do we go to a new place? No, we don't. However... There we go, we just got a med kit like that. Uh... Where else can we go? Yeah, might as well just be here and pick these up too while I'm at it. It kind of sucks because you have to go through the entire rigmarole roll every time you want to pick up everything. But I have a feeling that this is going to come in handy at some point. Alright, so let's go down here. We don't want to be down there. So, okay, teleport. Where did it teleport me now? I think we just got to keep go Well, we don't want to go there. There's a mega armor. Oh, what the hell, dude? <laughs> this is Doom 3. <laughs> That's exactly what Doom 3 would do. It, it, you'd have a drop, and uh, and you'd have you get you basically have a demon like like basically punching your dick when you're fucking behind him. I actually want to see if I can go through that door that I saw. No, the answer is no. All right. So I can't go that. Oh, here's another guy. Okay, so why, where haven't I been? I've been there, I think, no I haven't been there. Cause this goes somewhere else. Actually what happens if I go back through the teleport? I think it just goes back to the same place, right? Yes it does. Can I open this guy? No. I thought maybe the direction of the teleporter matters, but it hasn't seemed like that so far. That brings me here, that just does that. How the fuck do I get over there? There's, first of all, there, there's this thing. Oh, I see, it's actually right there. There's a secret exit thingy of above. Right here, you're supposed to be able to do it. Except you can't. All right. There's a lava thing, entrance here, which I, oh, that's the exit actually. There's that guy. Um, 
What else is there? I assume Watch Your Step has something to do with the teleporters. What it has to do with the teleporters, I'm not sure. But where do I go? When I go into this one, where do I go? I go... I don't even know where that is. Am I still on the same part of the map, is my question? I think I am. There, you know, I don't know if you guys have ever played Ken's Labyrinth, but there was a really dickish teleporter in, in the first level, or maybe the second level or something. Basically what it would do is it teleport you somewhere else, and then when you go back into the same tele teleporter to return, it would, uh, it would take you to actually another place that looked like the initial part of the level to trick you. And then it, it, there'd be like little weird things that were screwed up about it. I should play. To, I should play Kids Labyrinth for you guys sometime. You guys would really like that one. Actually, it, it's actually a really fun game. And then yeah, so they would, it would just basically do a bunch of things to trip you up and uh, and mess with you. And then yeah, it was actually really creative. Actually, Ken Silverman, by the way, is the guy who did like uh, uh, what was it called? Uh, he did like Duke Nukem 3D's engine and shit like that. So, alright, so I am completely and utterly fucking lost on what to do here. Not gonna lie. So, the level the level called Watch Your Step is, uh... Making me definitely watch my stuff. I'm gonna try and go back up. We did get a blue key card. Was there a blue door? Actually, it just occurred to me that I have that now. Oh, well. Ken Silverman, yes. That's the guy. But like his his first kind of game was like he programmed like a game with his uh, well he programmed a game for his brother because they both like shooters and uh, they like like Wolfenstein or whatever uh, and so they were like oh let's kind of make our own game and then Epic signed them on. I know Epic has a bad name right now but they were pretty good back in the day. I know everyone hates Epic right now. Uh, let's do rockets. I just turned the auto run off. So my finger slipped. Good thing I turned it on just so I could hurt myself again. You need to... The room you described in the, in the level of Ken's Labyrinth is more of a secret area. Was it a secret area? I thought it was just a regular part of the game. Because I thought, I thought like, you, you go in and you come back, but you're actually supposed to go through the, the door like three times. You know what? I'm actually happy that someone else knows what I'm referencing, to be honest. Here I was thinking it was an obscure game that nobody knew. And these guys do not seem to infight at all. Or maybe they do. I, I'm just happy someone else knows what Kin's Labyrinth is, because holy shit. I, well, there, there's always like these obscure DOS games, which I'm like, I love this, and then, oh shit, that's a Cyber Demon. I just saved on top of the Cyber Demon. Uh, let's uh, go back here and get some health somewhere. <laughs> I totally just saved. I, I, you know what? This looks really delicious right now. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> a Cyber Cyber Demon. <laughs> oh shit. I need some health. I need some health. Ah, here we go. Okay. This is the worst. Possible for me to get out over here from here now. Watch your step, they say. Have you ever experienced the winger, the the wonders of Dink Smallwood? Uh, no, and I don't know what that is. And for all I know, that could be a meme. Ah, <laughs> oh, man, just need a bit more HP. Well, I guess we're just gonna have to deal with twenty-eight HP. Those legit, si legit cyber demons. I mean, BFG, right? Oh, 
I mean, wh what else to use the fucking BFG on rather than two cyber demons that spawn out of fucking nowhere? Rip and tear. Achievement. Uh. <laughs> He's making imp noises. Stop that. You're not an imp. You're a cyber demon. You're supposed to be big and scary. Which is quite honestly the last thing I expected to spawn right behind me. Yeah, fuck that gun. It's making imp noises! <laughs> that death animation though. Alright. Oh hey. They're were they over there? Oh no, they were over here, never mind. <laughs> Sip noises. <laughs> Now, some noises is five dollars a month. All right, that's what that is. Oh, look, it's a, uh, it, it's it's a it's a Doom level design classic. It's a, uh, uh, the floor looks like lava, but doesn't actually hurt you. <laughs> hey, that seemed kind of final level, eh, didn't it? Oh no, we're entering spawn fear. Never mind. All right. Well, I think we're going to call it here, guys. I did save it, though.